Okay, I think we'll uh, finish up with this last video here. Uh, I'd like to show you kind of a quick and easy way to make a vicinity map uh, that will show where this parcel is in relation to the entire quarter section. Um, you remember that this parcel is situated in the southeast quarter of section 18. Um, and so what I'm going to recommend we do here is uh, I'm not going to go through big long explanations because we're kind of working between model space and paper space now. And let's just go back to our model. So if we click on this um, on this tab here, uh, right now we're in our layout, but let's go back to our model space by just clicking on that model tab there. And that's, um, you know, where we spend most of our time, like I said. And what I'd like you to do is copy eight lines. The four lines that represent the boundary of the quarter section, these four, and the four lines that represent the boundary of our parcel. So I'm just going to... Um, I'm just going to copy these. Uh, there might be a more elegant way to do this, but um, let's just give this a try. So one, two, three, four, and then I'll zoom in a little and I'll grab my four lines that represent the boundary of my parcel. Okay. And now I'll just pick that as my base point. I'm going to move these over here. Okay, I can erase these later. Uh, right now, let's just window these. Control C for copy. Go back to our layout tab. Control V to paste. Now this is going to be huge again. Uh, but we'll we'll deal with that. Control V, and I'm just going to paste it right here. Now, if we zoom out, we're going to see that. Oh my gosh, this thing is huge. That's okay. We're going to scale it down. So now I'm going to go back to my home tab, and I'm going to go to my uh, scale command here, and I'm going to scale uh, all those objects. Okay, right click to complete my selection set of objects. I'll use the endpoint. You see right here, I'm choosing that endpoint. And my scale factor is going to be, uh, I don't know why that didn't work. Let me try that again. Scale. Um, base point will be that endpoint. There we go. And now uh, the scale factor will be point zero zero one. Enter. And now I've got to zoom way back in here again. Here's my drawing. Now I'm going to take this uh, little eight lines. I'm going to say move and I'm going to move this onto my paper space uh, somewhere up in this area. Okay, now what this represents, of course, is the four lines of the quarter section and the four boundary lines of our parcel. So before we go any further, let's just cross-hatch our parcel. Um, and, you know, I'm still in my text layer. That'll be fine. I'm going to say uh, BH uh, for uh, hatching. So BH. And I'm going to pick a point inside that um, boundary there. Now, right now it's got a solid hatch pattern, which I wouldn't want. I'm going to go up here. I'm going to choose this one. ANSI, what is it? ANSI 31. And you might have to fiddle around with the scale, but um, that looks fine to me. So I'm just going to say uh, enter here. So now I have cross hatched my parcel. Uh, let's go ahead and make another text style. Uh, style is the command. Uh, 
I'm going to call it new, and I'll call this uh, PS text for paper space text. Now this I want to be real simple text, so I'm going to choose um, a style called Roman S. Here it is, very simple, Roman S. Uh, of course, you can see here what it looks like. Uh, it's real simple. And here I'm going to give it a height of 0 0.08. I'm not going to change the width factor or the oblique angle. I'll just say apply, set current, and close. Now I'm going to use single line text again, DT. And um, down here, uh, I'll just uh, define the orientation of the text. It should be horizontal. And I'm going to call this, uh, some people call it a location map, or I'll call it a vicinity map. And then I'm going to define that as being the southeast quarter of Section 18. And it turns out the scale of this in paper space will be 1 inch equals 1,000 feet. And I would always uh, put spaces on either side of the equal sign. It just looks better that way. Uh, hopefully I got my township and range numbers correct. But it's, a, it's just a little vicinity map here. And I'll hit Enter twice. And then what I'll do is I'll, I'll just kind of move things around here a little. Um, so I'm going to move this a little closer. Now, because these two, the west line of the quarter section and the north line of the quarter section are center lines of roads, I'm going to go ahead and add that information. So DT, again, for single line text. This one I'll actually line up with the section line itself. And this one is Oakwood Road. And then on the west side, we have Lake 5 Road. And I'm just uh, eyeballing where I want them to be. That's close enough. Whoops. Sometimes, let me just show you something. Sometimes object snaps get in your way, and um, you should know that you can use your shift right click. And there is an object snap called none, which means it's going to ignore all of them. And sometimes that's handy. So I'm going to put it right there. And uh, so now we've got a little vicinity map showing uh, where.